Suzuki Quad Runner 250. I think she's a 1995 two-wheel drive. Um, I was having an issue with the clutch slipping. She's a semi-automatic, uh, five-speed, reverse. So uh, I thought I was going to do clutch plates, but apparently with these semi-automatics you can adjust the clutch. They do slip at times. So I'm on the right side of the bike. I'm already got this started. So I'm on the right side of the bike underneath the fender skirt. And if you look in here, let's see if I can get some light on there for you. Now get some light. Now this down here that's your oil filter. Just above your oil filter and to the left is this cap nut. And that cap nut is a 17 millimeter. And apparently I've already loosened it. It doesn't take much. And apparently this is how you adjust your clutch. You take this off. It has a little o-ring on it. And inside there, it's very hard to pick up. There's not a lot of light here. That's a 12 millimeter with a set screw. So what I'm going to do, I can't, I'm only holding this with my phone, but just to let you know where it is. That's a 12 millimeter nut. That's a lock nut. So I'm going to release the lock nut. And then you can see it's a, it's a cross tread or what we call a Phillips head. Uh, screw right in the center. It's hard to pick up with this phone, but um, then you just turn it in until it just touches. You can feel it just bring up, and then you reset your lock nut, put it back together again, and that's supposed to fix the uh, slipping issue uh, with, the, with this bike. I used to put her in gear and give her a shot of gas, and she wouldn't move very much, just very, very slow. You said to rev, rev the engine up high just to get her moving. Put her in low gear, she moved better, and I thought for sure it was the clutch plates gone, but that's the first time I've come across this. So anyway, if you're looking to how to adjust the semi-automatic clutch, this on a Suzuki Quad, and it probably applies to the Arty Cats and a lot of other semi-automatic ones, uh, that's where it is too on this bike.